Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, I am all glammed up because I am actually heading to a premiere right now with Issa for the movie It Ends With Us. If you read the book, you know. I just wanted to check in with you because this vlog is going to be a little different because I'm actually going to be focusing it more around my outfits but of course i am late so i need to get out of this robe and i will give you guys more outfit details once i get there we're now on the way to meet isa at a cafe first because we're gonna get a little snack but i wish I wish you guys saw the struggle of me putting on this dress because it literally took me a good 15 minutes and I was sweating. I had to order a car because you will not catch me wearing this in the subway. It also drags on the floor so that would be really gross. Home from the premiere for It Ends With Us. I thought the movie overall was great. Maybe the outfits were a little horrendous and questionable, but who am I to judge? Now I'm home and I'm gonna change out of this because I'm probably just gonna be cooking and relaxing for the rest of the night. I'm gonna get out of this dress. I'm back and I have changed into the outfit of the night. <laughs> Honestly, who really cares about my bummy clothes, but this is an outfit vlog. So I'm gonna give you guys all the details. Top, Calvin Klein PJs. And then for my bottoms, set active, super comfy. These are my go-to. Is this giving brat summer? Good morning guys, we are once again starting our day in the kitchen. As you saw today, I am starting off my day with a hoji cha latte. This is 100% my favorite drink at the moment. It's just 
super comforting and I am already in my first outfit of the day because I am going to core power. So we have this little windbreaker thing. This whole outfit is from Set Active, by the way. This is not a onesie, it's a two piece. But I typically wear a onesie from Set just because they're so comfy and I'm a petite curvy girl and I feel more sucked in in those. But this set is also really comfy. I just love their stuff. I think the material is really comfortable. I'm wearing a size large for anyone who's curious. Anyways, that's the outfit for this morning. I need to finish my drink and head out to my class. Wait, I forgot to mention these glasses. They are vintage Gucci from Paris. They have a lot more of these kind of frames in Paris. <laughs> home now from core power i'm really glad that i wore this windbreaker because sometimes i'll bring a jacket and it's the summertime and no matter how gloomy it is it's still like 80 degrees but honestly it's feeling kind of like fall i also wanted to talk about these shoes i got these from a korean brand i think they're called the blackfish weather i'll double check but they're so comfy actually trying this kimbap that I got from Costco for the first time. Let me just microwave it. So I wonder how it's going to taste. It smells really good actually. This is what it looks like. This is my lunch. I have an event to go to with Issa in a little bit, which is correlating to the movie that we watched yesterday. I'm going to try it. The flavor is pretty good. Anyways, I'll see you when I get ready. Okay, before I show you guys the full outfit, I've had a lot of people ask me how I do my low slick back bun. I know my hair looks crazy right now because usually it is better to do it on second day hair, which is why mine actually looks insane. This brush makes the process 10 times easier. This is the hair gel that I use, like this much. That's how much I take. And then, I just run it through my hair. And like, literally, you can tell it's already in shape. I take another hair tie. I just twist my hair. I'm sure you guys have done this before. Twist, twist, twist. And that's the bun. Honestly, I, I never know what the back of my head looks like, so. And that's it. Super easy and simple. For the outfit for tonight, I'm keeping it pretty simple. The top is from Brandy Melville. I got this 10 bajillion years ago. And then the jeans, I got these from Korea and they're still one of my favorites. They're just very baggy and comfortable. I got them from a store called Klo. I showed it in my Seoul vlog, so if you guys are traveling to Korea, make sure you guys go check it out. I also am in a size large in these. I'm feeling a bit of gold today. So this one is from a brand called Defoe. This one is from Who Is She Again, I believe, and this is Monica Vinader. For bag, I was just thinking this simple one from Loewe. I thrifted this in Japan <laughs> and I wear it at least three times a week. I love the shape. I love a good lunchbox shaped purse. The star of the show, it's these. So this is the outfit. Last minute decision. It's a little cold outside, so. I'm putting on this gray jacket from Grove. I also got this in Korea. Perfect for this kind of weather. All right, now I'm really late, gotta go.
so gooey. <laughs> didn't have time to change for day night, so we're sticking with this outfit. I am home from dinner and I am in my last and favorite outfit of every day. I don't know why today felt so long, but I am ready to go to bed. So I will be seeing you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning, guys. It's actually already 2 p.m. in the afternoon. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the weather. Maybe it's my period. But I have not done anything all day. I do have dinner plans with my boyfriend for an event, which is super exciting. So I'll probably get dressed up for that. But for now, it's PJs until I need to leave the house. Ugh, I don't know what it is. Okay guys, this is the outfit that I came up with for tonight. I don't know what my process was. <laughs> event that was so much fun we went to bond street the food was delicious the dessert was great and the team was honestly the kindest people anywho enough rambling from me i will see you guys tomorrow morning they're excluding me
I just did in a woke vintage. I'm wearing my mom's vintage Dior bag. She's so cute. And then I thrifted this in Paris. And my go-to slippers from Kearney. for bed and do some editing for the rest of the night. 